Hi everyone, I haven't made a video in my kitchen and excuse the mess behind me. Um, I wanted to make another video regarding MS. Um, I told you in the last one that I was diagnosed August 13th with relapsing remitting. That was after two years of symptoms. And Shared Solutions has and Capaxone have been sending me a ton of stuff on Capaxone. So again, for those of you just starting, definitely look into Shared Solutions because it's great. Um, they send you a 2000, well mine's 2008, it's a 2008 daily planner. See it says Copaxone. Um, it's basically, um, you write down any of your symptoms, any problems that you've had. It tells you where to inject um, in this little chart right here. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but it goes through the entire year telling you what to do. Um, you write down symptoms that you had that were troublesome, questions to ask your doctor. Last month, there's the, your small victory. Always write down at least one. It's something that's good for you. Um, the number of injections that you missed, injection site concerns, things like that. It's a really nice planner. Um, also, in my last video, I didn't send, I didn't show you anything relating to the Autoject 2, which I did get in the mail probably a week after I made that video. It came in this little box. Um, empty. I still don't have my medicine yet because I signed up on Medicaid. I don't have health insurance. I signed up on Medicaid to get it, and that should be it should be done this week. But they send you the Autoject 2, which is this thing. This is where your needle goes. I'm not completely sure how this works. The nurse still has to come and talk to me about it. But this is basically it. You're also not supposed to fire it if there's no needle in it. And even when you do, it's loud and scary. But um, Autoject 2 sends you a little bag for that and your um, alcohol wipes and anything else you need to take your shot. Um, Shared Solution sends you this big huge canvas bag. Inside the bag you are given a ton of stuff. Um, things to keep track of your injection site. I'm making a mess on my counter while I do this. Um, an ice pa uh, hot and cold compress. Um, Someone else I had talked to that has MS told me, and that does injections, um, told me that this is definitely one of your best friends. Mine's still in bubble wrap because I haven't had to use it yet because I haven't started any injections. This is a magnetic chart that goes on your fridge. You can go on your fridge. That's where it's going to go on mine. tells you where to inject. It also comes with a dry erase marker, and you can wipe it off. It's really nice. Um, also, a picture frame that you can, I'm going to put it again on my fridge, it says this is why I take my Copaxone every day. It's a cool little magnet. I know, I'm a dork. <laughs> um, labels to put on your syringes or on your needles to keep track of when you refrigerate them. If you do. You can, as far as I know. And also a brochure. Simple steps on how to use the autoject. Um, simple steps for administering your therapy. It's in this little brochure right here. And that's basically it. They give you a ton of stuff to get you started. I'm still really nervous about starting and the fact that I don't have my medicine yet is kind of overwhelming because I was diagnosed on August 13th. That was in a week and a half. It'll be a month since I've been diagnosed and still no therapy. I've been okay as far as relapses go. Um, it was really hot out today. I had a lot of problems today um, with feeling dizzy and um, not really being able to talk, I guess. And I look awful <laughs> because this morning I was just frazzled. It was ridiculous. Um, and I haven't been feeling well at all for the past couple days. But I just wanted to make a quick video. Again, I apologize for the scenery. I still have to clean my kitchen. <laughs> and my cat's meowing in the background. Um, so, yeah, I'll post another one soon. Bye!